application of enzyme to laundry. We will present three types of enzyme, which is protease, lipase, and amylase. First, protease. Protease also called as proteolytic enzyme, proteinase, and peptidase. Protease break long chain molecule of protein into short two fragments. There are two major groups of proteins. Protein remove protein stains such as grass, blood, egg, and human sweat through proteolysis. Protein stain will undergo proteolysis and convert into polypeptide and single amino acid. This is easy to wash because it's already in small molecule. Protease clean stains from body secretion such as blood. Strain protease is downstream processing of microbes through enzyme production and are compatible with commercial detergent. Protease are more adapted to lower temperatures, just suitable for washing in cold water. Nature stains make them less accessible for enzyme to degrade. Initial types of protease are stable to be in detergent formulation because enzymes are required in detergent formulation for protease stability where it can remain functional. Lipase is biotechnology based cleaning agent that are widely used in industry and it is the most important group of biocatalyzed in biotechnology application. Sources, edible oil, chocolate and cosmetic stand are very hard to remove because they are formed due to the greasy food stand. How it works? Lipase hydrolyzes the water insoluble triglyceride component into the more water soluble product. Lipase then decomposes a fatty stand up to 25%. During the drying cycle, when the water content is decreased, the enzyme is activated and can hydrolyze the triglyceride. This facilitates the removal of stain in the next wash cycle. The enzyme also has stability over a broad range of temperature between 30 to 60 degrees Celsius. This novel alkaline lipase retains 100% activity in the presence of strong oxidant. Advantages of using lipases in detergents are First, lipase have low substrate specificity to hydrolyze fat. Second, able to withstand extreme temperature and pH. Third, able to remove greasy stain by specific lipases. Fourth, alkaline yeast lipases can work at low temperature to remove fats and oil. Last one, can be applied in cold washing. What are the challenges of using lipases in detergent? Lipase enzymes are very expensive to produce only effective after several wash cycles and must be used with several other enzymes. Amylase was discovered by Ansel Mepoyon in 1833 and then this enzyme was found that can break bigger such molecules, smaller molecules and then it has three groups, alpha, beta and gamma. What is amylase? Amylase is a type of enzyme which hydrolyzes starch. Alpha amylase, which is one of the degradation enzymes usually preferred in laundry works, as this enzyme will cleave the interior alpha-1 folding cages of starch into short-chain sugars which are water-soluble. Amylase production must use specific methods in order to achieve good moisture in the culture to produce high quality and high numbers of Alpha amylase and good stable alpha amylase against pH, temperature, and hydrolysis process. One of the advantages of amylase in detergent industry are amylase active at low temperature, which are preferred as the energy consumption gets reduced, the whole process becomes cost effective. Oxidative stability of amylase became an advantage since washing environment is very oxidizing. Next, three-dimensional structure of amylase promotes the breakage of glycosidic stains in starch. And lastly, the use of amylase in detergent can inhibit the growing of white fabric, resulting from a combination of starch and particulate soiling.